Welcome to Drinking Bros, presented by GhostBed.com. Let's say your wife or husband dies, right? Yep. You hit up one of your old flings that you used to date back in the day. Would you sit there and go through their nudes in bed with them and, and masturbate to what they looked like back when they were 30 as opposed to like 70? Fuck yes. No. <laughs> so it's, mm. Could you do it? That's the thing. So this is what I said could to Jared. I? Sure, yeah. I'll do anything. I don't give a shit. But I just don't see the utility in doing that. I would like, I would be more prone because look, a woman of that age is going to be either set and doesn't want to do any weird shit anymore or she's bored now and wants to do all the weird shit. Right. So I'm not going to sit around looking at fucking pictures with her. I'm going to be inviting other people in. And watching them rail her or suck my dick but, but or whatever it, the case right, is. But, it's, <laughs> it, but here's the point. And this is, this is where it gets really fascinating because it's what Jared said. At 70, it's not going to be like it is now, right? You're not going to – there's not going to be a team of people that want to gangbang your, your wife. No, dude. You can find other people in your age group to fuck anywhere you go forever. But that's not attractive. And that's what Jared attractive was saying. Attractive to whom? It's attractive to well, other no, people I mean, in their 60s You're probably going to be able to – you're probably going to be able to pull up one of these pictures and like and and map their body in front of you. Yeah, like your, a hologram. Your little yeah, yeah. And it's just like, oh, look, we look like we used to, and then you just do it. Yeah, that'd be dope. Oh man, that'd be weird though. I mean, they're oh. already they're already kind of doing that. Yeah, but if you were lying next to your, if you were seventy, she was seventy, um, and then you know, you're... I was seeing I was seeing her at thirty. Yeah, it, it, yeah. like. Are you are you having sex with her and looking at her thirty year old image? Yeah, why wouldn't I'd want her to look, look at my? You're, you're missing image. you're missing a critical point of this though. With the advances recently in anti aging, uh -huh. HGH uh, and reversal of cellular degeneration. Yep, we may be able to come into a stasis period with regard to aging as human beings by that point. So we may be able to even like literally the, the anti aging thing is nonsense. The phrase is nonsense. You age no matter what, but right. You can certainly defeat a lot of the effects of it. Mm -hmm. And you're talking about broadcasting a hologram over a 3D image. I'm talking about making her look like she's in her 30s again when she's 70. Oof. I, I, so here's, I, I think we're past that age, right? I think the next generation might, might have some shit like that. I think this age, probably not. But maybe the I next generation. I think we're more so going to go to the uh, uh, altered carbon style. Maybe, yeah. But that's I think, fine, I too. I think we're... I, expl yeah, but, explain but I that. Think, it's a well, so, con consciousness transference. Yeah. Basically. So altered carbon. You had a stack. Your stack essentially was your was your consciousness and your brain, and then your sleeve was a was was just a living organism body that was grown in 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 a. I mean, Japan and China are already doing this right now. Like growing, you know, they just got approved to merge a, a human and animal. DNA yes, yes. So they're doing it with with, um, with a monkey. It's not. A, I mean, and it's we're approved also, by China, but no one else. Obviously, we're close to <clears throat> downloading consciousness too. So I think I, I think that comes in the next <clears throat> twenty years, and I think altered carbon comes true in our lifetime. Yeah, we might. By the time we're seventy, we might be able to go plug our brain in, scan it, put it onto a drive, and then put us into a new body. Fuck, whose body is it then? Uh, whom, it's a grown body. It's it's whomever I want. Yeah, you choose. Like you get to make the body. Yeah, you okay. like. I want green eyes. I want to be thin. I want to be athletic. I want to be. You know, wow. Uh, that, give me that, another inch. Give me one more inch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. One more inch. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody on Earth is gonna be a fucking cyborg with a ten inch dick. Dude, yeah. once you yeah, once you completely map the human DNA system and you're, are able to alter it and then grow it you're just i mean it's just plug and play at that point Can you